What's going on YouTube? BMS Trash Talk here, and thank you for tuning in. But today, this will be part two of my uh, 400 uh, cranks made by Redline. And there was some rust on there that I wanted to take off because I'm going to redo a bike. And I went ahead and took off the sprocket because I had, I had this sprocket on the cranks when I set it inside this Evaporus. And um, once I got done with the video, I was like, well, let me take it off so I can, you know, put the, ha have more room to stick the cranks in there and stick other parts in there. So I went ahead and added the bolts, the chain ring bolts in there. Then I took this um, and one of the, uh, the hobbyists uh, chimed in on it in the comments about aluminum. He wasn't too sure if uh, aluminum with this um, evaporus, if it was going to damage the uh, aluminum. So, um, but I went ahead and took it off and all I did was just scrubbed it real good because it had a little grime around where the teeth are, where the chain goes. And I went ahead and uh, scrubbed it down with Dawn and water and just a scrub brush. So, it definitely got the rust off the threads. And as you can see, you can see the color difference. Let me zoom out just a little bit. But you can see the color difference right there. It was black, now it's like a lighter gray. And what I'll do is, I'll take this outside and I'll go wash it off with some water real good. And then I'll dry it, and then I'll stick the other side back in there. So it did take the, the rust off. And where it's um, the rust is, what the rust was um, right here, where it's the chrome looks like it's, it's peeling up a little bit. It came off, and it came off on the threads. And the decal stayed on, so that's a good thing. And the bearings had some some rust on them too. And as I was taking this apart, uh, this is Sagino too. So this is a complete complete set. Um, and what it looks like, it looks like that Sagino and Redline either work together, partner together, or Sagino makes Redline cranks. So that's another thing to look at. And these are the bolts that go on the, the crank arms. And these bolts right here I had on the old sprocket that I had on a, on a bike. I'm not gonna say the bike name because if I do, then you guys will know which bike I put these cranks on. Some, some of y'all might know. They came out real clean. And these other chain ring bolts were on the rail line cranks and they came out nice. And these did too. So I'm happy that I'm able to get the rust off or somebody came out with a product that can get the rust off, especially whenever you're rebuilding the bike. And I know some of y'all are thinking, well, how come you didn't just go get the, the acid and just made a, a big batch and uh, you can just do everything at one time? And yes, I could have done that, but I had already had this stuff and you know, I bought the crank, so I'm going to use all this up and then I'll move on to something else. But I have um, another project coming up that I am going to be using the uh, the acid. And um, I'm going to be, actually I got about three or four bikes that I'm going to be using that stuff with. So uh, so I can go back, because I've seen a couple of rust spots on a couple of my, my bikes. The Tahoe have some, so I want to go ahead, I'm going to take down that whole bike and put the frame in there. But I need to know 
is that stuff going to take off the decals or not? I'm not sure about that. If it is, I might just use, because it's not that much on there. Actually, it's right here. It's not that much on here. Like right here. I'll probably just take some foil paper on there. I think it was some down here. So I'll just go take like a little brass brush and get in there those small areas but yeah like right here too yeah so i'll just i'll just probably just use a uh foil paper with this that way i'm thinking about changing out these uh cups right here these right here so This is a video, the part two of my cranks getting cleaned up, getting the rust taken off. And I'll go ahead and uh, rinse them off with water. And then I'll have part three of everything already fully put together and everything nice and clean. So if you like what I'm doing, hit that subscribe, like the video, please share it. Hit that notification bell, that way you catch my videos as they come out. This stuff is working good and the color is changing so maybe the you know next time i'll probably put something in here like a chain or so it'll probably be all black by then dealing with the chain but i'll see you guys in the next one later